Hello everyone, how are you doing? I hope that you are doing so very well. Today I'm here with another Owl Crate unboxing. All of my videos lately have just been wrap up Owl Crate, wrap up Owl Crate, but I have a lot more things coming down the pipeline, especially because Booktubeathon is next week and I am planning to participate every single day in reading and in making the videos. It'll be a good time. I'm super excited. Booktubeathon is always a fun time, but it's also always very challenging because I work a full-time job. I'll be posting my TBR on my Instagram. That's what I normally do. I am also using my mic to Today, finally because I got a hot shoe adapter thanks to everyone on Twitter who told me that including Kat and Natasha and Christine bless you guys this month's box theme is wanderlust and I am super excited wanderlust is my life y'all today I don't have scissors but I do have a pen it's working just fine you know like moderately fine <laughs> Look at this card. It says greetings from Alcrate and it shows somebody on a beach with their Gryffindor t-shirt and it's all like old school postcard style. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. And then the back looks like a postcard too, but that's spoilers. First up, we've got this mini pop Funko figure of Newt Scamander. So precious. Look at how cute baby Newt is. He's gonna fit perfectly on my Harry Potter shelf. It's right there. You guys don't see it a lot because it's behind me, but I have a whole Harry Potter shelf. It's a great time. His little suitcase. Oh my god. I can't do. Also, this is a keychain. Very tempted to actually put it on my key because I don't have a keychain right now. I'll probably, you know, keep it on my shelf. Oh my gosh, yes. It's a backpack. <laughs> Next up, we've got this amazing backpack that's canvas and it has a quote from the Fellowship of the Ring. And this is also the ring inscription. I love it so much. I really feel like watching the movies now after seeing this. I like that it's canvas too, which means it's not gonna break as easily, you know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh. And this backpack was made by the lovely folks at Owlcrate. They made this. Whenever Owlcrate has exclusive stuff in their boxes made by them, I'm so impressed because it's like, yes, yeah, you have like this business and you also make stuff. So beautiful. Next up is this super awesome pocket mirror made by Miss Fi. It says Oz Travers. I don't really know if that's how you pronounce that, but it's from A Darker Shade of Magic, which I've read the first book of. Someday soon I will finish the trilogy. But this is so pretty. It has a little rose on it and it's so pretty. And it also came in this beautiful bag. Beautiful. I love it so much. Next up is this owl bag tag and it's from Mud Puppy. Keeping in the theme of travel and wanderlust, this is a very super cute bag tag. I have one right now, but this is a lot cuter than that. It's adorable and very fitting with the owl crate. You get it? We'll definitely be using this on my next adventure, aka Booknet Fest. Next up is this pocket journal from Uli, which is so cute. It's got a little cityscape on it. Apparently, owl crates sent out eight different ones of this. So this is the one that I got and it's just, you know, to write down all your travel memes. I was actually literally just looking at flights to Paris today. So this is very coincidental. Next up is the Owl Crate pin of the month, which just has a little palm tree, a little airplane, just so cute. Perfection. Next up is this art print by Shaylee Ann Designs, and it is inspired by Looking for Alaska, hence Alaska, and it is a quote from somebody. I read their name. Honestly, you couldn't pronounce it, so I'll just like put it here. I'm so bad at names. Ha, ha. It's fine. Definitely like this art print a lot more than the actual book Looking for Alaska. I was just not a fan of that one. This is beautiful. And I will display it proudly because I love this quote. Yes! The book for this month is The Gentleman's Guide to Vice and Virtue by Mackenzie Lee. And it's also an Alcrit exclusive cover. Look at this! This is one I've actually seen everywhere and I know a bit about. But I know the highlight color on the other ones is green and this one is blue. Again, with the Alcrit cover and me loving it way more than the normal cover. It's so beautiful. I love it so much. Along with the book, we've got this Gentleman's Guide to Europe, which has all the countries and just some little illustrations on there. So, so cute. As well as a signed book plate and a note from the author, which is probably my favorite note from the author I've ever seen. It's got some little illustrations all over it. I just want to follow this author just because of this. I love this. So this book is about Henry Monty Montague. He has just always been one for pleasure and vice, and he has a lot of passions, including men and women. I know from the card he's queer. I'm not sure if he's bisexual or what orientation is. I'm guessing we will find out in the book. But now he is embarking on a year-long tour of Europe to cap off his time kind of being that person, being that playboy, because he is supposed to take over his family's estate. So he's gonna travel all around Europe, I'm guessing, to like all the countries on the map, and is really in love with his best friend Percy, so he's gonna flirt with him as well. But he makes some bad choices, and then the year-long tour becomes kind of a manhunt, and I'm guessing there's some adventure, and there's some intrigue, and just different stuff like that, and it sounds so good. I've heard incredible things about this so far. I am super excited to read this, and I love this cover. Exclusive cover, Alcrate, you do it again, you're killing it every single 
single time. I love it. Next month's theme is Something Wicked This Way Comes. The sneak peek is that there will be a book from Rock Paper Books, and if you know me at all, you know that I'm a huge fan of the Rock Paper Books books. They're down there. You can't see them. But the two that have been in out crates have been absolutely amazing. I've just been like, I'm shook, shook to my core. I love them so much. They're so beautiful. I would buy all of them if I could, so I am super excited about that. And if you want to get 15% off your first box, you can use my code Maureen. Alcrate just wants to share the love, so get on that. Get yourself an Alcrate box for next month, August. And here's everything that was in the Alcrate box. Yes! We've got the Alcrate pin of the month, this incredibly adorable Newt Scamander Funko Pop keychain, this notebook from Uli, this print from Shaylee Ann Designs, this incredible backpack inspired by Lord of the Rings made by the awesome people at Alcrate, this bag tag from Mud Puppy, this map, letter from the author, and signed book plate, as well as the book The Gentleman's Guide to Vice and Virtue by Mackenzie Lee. So much good stuff in this box. I love this backpack so much. It's amazing. I love it. I love it. And that's it for unboxing the Alcrate July box. I loved it a lot. I really loved the backpack. As you probably could tell, that was my favorite thing of the box. But what was your favorite thing? I want to know. I want to talk to you about it. Thank you as always to Alcrate for sending me this box. I so appreciate it and I love them every single time. They're so beautiful. They're so amazing. I love them. And thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you next time. Bye. But first, let me take a thumbnail. Francois, Francis, Rabalis.